guys, welcome to my uh, first video log, so uh, be, be gentle. So it's uh, Monday the 8th of August. Yep. We've decided uh, we need to get back on, uh, not necessarily a diet, but a fitness plan. As you probably, probably follow my original transformation, seven months along, and uh, between work, our know, family holidays and bits and pieces. Well, to be honest, before the family holiday, training was going great. We've both come back, uh, me and my better half, Carla, a few kilos up, me a few more than her, and decided it's a great time to do another diet or mini transformation. And we decided, you know, firstly I've decided I want to drag her along to do it along with me, because she looks better on camera. And uh, <laughs> no, secondly, it's a great opportunity for us to show you more about how to fit fitness into busy lifestyles, how it works around things, and sort of how you, you know, you have to be consistent, but you don't have to be militant. So hopefully we're gonna give you guys a lot of uh, interesting insights and exciting things that you can take away and apply to yourself. I mean, the first time you've kind of seen Carla do a lot of bits and pieces. So hopefully, uh, hopefully you'll enjoy that as well. I can't hold the camera properly, I'm sorry. Okay, useless. <laughs> so, yeah, so basically we've got, um, we've, I mean, I think I put on uh, six kilos in Turkey. Carla put on two or three. Yeah. So we're not on any massive, massive rush to lose or anything like that. But basically I wanted to get back on exactly the same plan I did for my transformation. And we've got three weeks before we uh, go away again. So we thought it would be a, a fun way to show you sort of what can be done in those three weeks without going nuts. To just following the same consistent plan I followed before, you're going to see you know, how, how the differences and the similarities of sort of male and female training and stuff like that. We try and train together as much as we can. Obviously schedules and stuff like that don't necessarily always allow that. So you can uh, obviously follow myself on here. Carla's gonna hopefully do as many vlogs as she can, but you can also find her and information about her on her socials as well. Yeah, I'll be posting uh, uh, my diet plan and uh, my exercises or my daily exercises uh, on my Facebook page, which is Curvy C. Uh, so if you guys are not following me yet, please do so. Um, and yeah, I'll be doing a few vlogs, uh, trying to post everything I eat and everything I do, just so to give you an idea. Um, I don't have as much weight to lose as Simon has uh, because he was a fatty on holiday. <laughs> he was eating too much. So uh, yeah, he's put on five kilos in a week. Uh, I put on two. Most probably the alcohol I was drinking, which I hardly drink and uh, I kind of abused it this holiday. Uh, we really wanted to relax, so we did. So now I've gone, as he said, you three weeks to go to Portugal. Um, so yeah, I want to turn up a little bit and all lose those two kilos that I put on um, so I'm gonna do it with him. So today today was our first day starting back because you always start on a Monday. Yeah. Weirdly enough. So I had an incredibly incredibly busy day so I had to get up early and do do my meal prep because obviously I need to eat a lot more than Carla which is uh, opposite to what a lot of people think is on a diet you're gonna cut down. A lot of time if you eat clean food and get the calories you need you end up having to eat more. So I done a video a little bit of the food prep to show you sort of stuff be eaten on a consistent basis. And then we've been uh, been up north for meetings all day today. So we've actually managed to hit, hit a chest workout. We got some video footage of that for you. So yeah. I'll ping that up there. For me, the first phase of my training on the transformation was a strength phase. So the goal for me for the next three, three or four weeks is still again, gonna be to get my strength up as much as possible. You know, Carla quite enjoys that style of training as well. I do. So she jumped in today and had some you know, great lifts. Considering we both had a, a solid week of uh, rest last week, didn't step inside a gym on holiday, had plenty of waffles and massages and Turkish baths. <laughs> so we've come back 100% fresh and excited to kind of hit it. So hopefully there's some interesting stuff there today already. Tomorrow I've got another busy day shooting. So I'm going to try and get a little bit of video content of that and then tomorrow's uh, back back and biceps so we're going to get some video I like of back that. and biceps, they're good, that's easy. Exactly, we should get some video left of that. All that's left for us to do today is I think I've got a couple more meals to get in. We've got to get, try and get around the dreaded M25, get home, yeah, take, traffic the, is not good. take the puppy, puppy for a walk. So that's counted as very low intensity cardio because he he likes to stop every 10 <laughs> yards and that's going to be day one so basically we want to keep this blog going 
long term for you. But the aim is to get sort of nice content in the next three weeks and then hopefully, you know, take you to Portugal, still train in Portugal and still get you sort of the mix of uh, hopefully not the cappuccinos and answers, but just a general sort of lifestyle thing, showing how you can incorporate fitness into a busy lifestyle. Yeah. Okay, guys, so we'll leave you there. Uh, we are. We will post a few of the videos that we recorded today um, at the gym. Uh, strength was good um, for the first day. Could have gone heavier. Decided not to because we don't want to get injuries and uh, the first day, if you know what I mean. Uh, and you want to take it easy to start with. Um, by the end of the week, obviously we're pushing a little bit heavier because um, we have to. Three weeks is not a lot of time, so you really have to be a little bit strict with what we eat and the way we exercise um, but it'll be worth it it's always worth it when you look better <laughs> at the end of the day so anyway we leave you there for now and uh, we'll see you soon okay don't forget follow us on socials bye